Amanda! Hey Marcus, how you mate been? Yeah, you've been good, eh? He just started working at that big health service there as an Aboriginal health worker. Bloody good job, he reckons. Yeah, does he work in that bigger truck I've seen? Yeah, he does sometimes. He gets to travel around to all the communities around the goldfields here. And he does health checkups, even STI checks, which is all free and confidential. That's awesome, yeah. Even that place on Ware Street, Population Health, do those tests for STIs. And it's all free and confidential as well. I heard STIs in the goldfields are pretty bad. So it's good they got places like Bigger and Population Health to provide services for everyone. Hang on a minute, what's an STI? STI stands for sexually transmitted infection and is caught from having unprotected sex. Some types like chlamydia often have no symptoms, so you should always wear protection. So if someone wants to have an STI, how would they get rid of it? I read ages ago that it's usually bronze with tablets. Well, sometimes people might need an antibiotic in a needle and it's gone within a week or so. Population health and Bega also give out free condoms, so there should never be any excuse for us not to have any. We need to always be prepared and it's better to be safe than sorry. How would you prevent an STI? Well, condoms are the best thing for protection against STIs. The biggest STIs that affect people in the community today is chlamydia and gonorrhea. But then you just can't forget about those blood viruses either. I'd still be ashamed to go and get a test though. Why would you feel shame? For us girls, all you gotta do is get a swab test. They can do it or better off, we can do it ourselves for more privacy. You guys, you just get the easy part and you have to piss in the cup. Yeah, boy. If you ask about those blood viruses with them, they can do a quick blood test for you as well. Well, my mate says that both Bega and Population Health are both very confidential and not allowed to say anything to anyone about the reason you were there or your results, so don't ever feel embarrassed. But I'm sure if you do, if you just give them a call, they'll be able to help you out. I know they both have Aboriginal staff to make it easier and be more supportive for us Aboriginal people. Oh, awesome. That's good. And other things in young people getting drunk and having sex, people should make sure they got condoms and try to be responsible about it. Think protection before affection, my brain used to say to me. What's that? Protection before affection. Sounds pretty cool. Protection before affection? Solid. I like it. Well, all I can say is go and get your condoms for free. And if anyone has had unprotected sex, go and get a test. Well, I just learnt something today. I didn't know it was that easy, eh? You just want to know something else? Yeah, what? what? Those sausages are burning a bit like the feeling of the STI when you piss. Ah, you won't get them sausages on!